Hello everyone. Welcome to the next lecture on the CSR Net 2019 Mathematics Solution. Today we will discuss about the shortcut tricks related to the quadrature formula. Like here. So this is the question which are asked in the part C. That it's definitely so 4.75 marks. How you can solve this question within a one minutes? What is the trick behind that? You have to follow this trick whenever there is a question related to this quadrature formula asked in the examination. so how you can solve that if you read the statement very carefully whenever whenever there is a related to the quadrature formula and such kind of the equations are given to you so what is that it is a polynomial so what what is the polynomial is it mentioned that is of the degree 2 degree 3 degree 4 and no in this particular example it is not mentioned that it means you have to consider any of the polynomial degree so let's say i consider the polynomial of of degree say Simplest one is degree one. So what are the bases are there? One and x are the uh, polynomial degree of this, like of a plus b x. So that's very simple. Now if you look about the options, you can see alpha are all same. So it means there is no need to compute the value of the alpha. A are changes. B are again same. So there is no need to compute the b. So it means our targets to compute a and c. So let's say if I consider f of x is my one. what will happen if i substitute this value here it is my 1 so if you integrate them it will be my 2 it will be my 0 so it is my a alpha f of this is now 1 b of again 1 plus of c now since b is given as a 8 by 9 in each of the case so if i substitute b as 8 by 8 by 9 so what is that this is nothing but my 10 by 9 you can see that 2 upon 8 here now you can substitute the second value of this when x is f of x is my x what will happen this is nothing but x minus x square so if x integration of the x is my 0 x square is nothing but my minus of 2 by 3 f of minus alpha so it is minus a alpha f of 0 is 0 c alpha is my here now you have the two equations you can easily equate them otherwise what you can do is you can simply add them a plus c should be 10 by 9 so can the first option be true yes it will be cancel out a plus c is 10 by 9 what is that this is nothing but my okay so this option is true this option is also true this is also true this is also true so that's very simple now how you can do that you can simply multiply this by alpha and add them so a alpha will be cancel out so it will be my 2c alpha it is 10 alpha by 9 minus of 2 by 3 so what is the value of the c 2 alpha will be divided so it's a 5 by 9 minus of 1 by 3 alpha so it's a negative sign so it means this option is cancel out plus this option is cancel out now the two options are there substitute the value of the alpha so what is that this is 5 by 9 minus 1 by 3 of root 5 by 3 now you can see that 5 by 9 that's true it can be root 5 so it means you can see that first option is correct one so that's the right answer is this one also true if you common 5 by 9 take as a common what will happen this is 9 by 5 of root 5 upon here so what is that this will be cancel out this is the root 5 and root 3 that is also the correct answer so the right answer of this problem is 1 and 4 so whatever the polynomial degree are there there is no need to compute x x k you can take a simple of the x there is a degree 1 and try to find it that's the simple way we will see some more questions related to this gate uh, net 2019 in our next video till then follow this channels share this videos thank you very much happy learning